it seems like we're already living into tomorrow, if you will. Well, we're talking with a company now that designs robots for the home to improve our lives. And they're doing some pretty unique things. The CEO and chairman of Nito Robotics, as it would be known in the U.S., or Niato Robotics here in Germany, is, um, my, my, um, oh my gosh, I forgot how to say your first name properly. Giacomo. Giacomo Marini. Giacomo, welcome into tomorrow. How are you, sir? Very well, Dave. Very well. Glad to have you with us. Uh, tell me, first of all, about the company. Uh, you say here, Neato Robotics, uh, yep. uh, or we would know it as Neato, because it's spelled easily that way, N-E-A-T-O, like Neato. Like yep. We would say in our slang is, oh, Neato. You yeah, know? Neato, absolutely. Neato Robotics. Um, this looks like perhaps a, a vacuum cleaner for the home. Uh, a, a, uh, those who might be familiar with Roomba, the that ones is. who kind of set the stage for that, uh, would understand. But this is your version. How is it different? Uh, it is different because it is based on a mapping technology that we introduced since the very beginning of uh, launching our company and our products, uh -huh. which is based on a laser-based technology. L you see this little turret on the on top of the Yeah, of there's, the a, there's a little turret. Think of a tiny tank. A tiny <laughs> so tank. there's a turret on top with the, the uh, NITO it, logo, and it, it does uh, a laser? Uh, it, it does a laser in there. And it, for those of you who have seen... Uh, the Google self-driving vehicle. Yeah. On top of the Google self-driving vehicle, there is a little turret. Yeah, okay. and it spins that around. Uh, it spins around, and that turret contains 64 lasers that map the environment around the car. Okay. This is a very similar technology. We have a much simpler turret with a single laser that maps uh, the rooms of your house. Oh, uh, nice. And, and so it's very, very similar to that. We use technology that is known as uh, simultaneous uh, localization and mapping, uh, but it's fundamentally the same technology. So what uh, we did with this was uh, we, we put this technology in the robot, and this allowed us to um, navigate in a regular way so we can navigate directionally so we know which direction we are because we have a map of the house. Uh, yeah. I can show you on sure. the map. So, yeah. so on, on, yeah, uh, so on the iPad here, there, whoops. Yeah, just zoomed into it or something. There yeah. we go. There's kind of a map of the house. Which has been created, generated by the, the laser mapping technology okay. that we have. So we map the house and so we can we can um, navigate through the house in a regular way. This has, has had a very important implication for us because we could design this particular uh, shape, which we call a D shape. It looks like a D. Yeah. Like, D okay. for Dave. Yeah. D, so D for job. Dave, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Uh, which has a great advantage because it goes along the walls in a straight way. So you see the straight uh, side. Unlike the others that are uh, just round, round and they miss a lot. Th they miss a lot uh. and goes to the corner. So if you have the corner of your room, you see this corner will go into the corner of yeah. your room. So now, for those listening on the radio so yeah. far and you don't see it, well, of course, visit intotomorrow.com and you'll see uh, the uh, interview uh, for Neo Robotics. And you're going to see the video of all the radio interviews this week, so have no fear. It is a unique design. I like, does it go yeah. uh, it it forwards always, and backwards? It always uh, goes, go, goes this, this okay, way. Okay, good. So it's it catching only, corners and, yeah, and it baseboards. Corners and and baseboards and all that type of stuff. Yeah. But also has an, a number of other implications because having been able to have this shape with the D shape, we have been able to put in here a much bigger brush in the front so that oh, goes yeah, much yeah. closer to the wall, both on the side and on the front. If you look at the other robots, they have it in the center. Yes. Okay. And right. that's why they miss a lot. They miss a lot. Especially so going up against the wall. So exactly. Exactly. And then the mapping technology helps because you can just tell it go home or start cleaning or do uh, whatever. Absolutely. Absolutely. And it does. It, of course, I'm assuming it goes into its charging base it automatically. Goes, it goes into a charging base automatically. It recharges multiple times if uh, if it needs more uh, more power for uh, to to do uh, the the. Apps. Right, to do a, yep. good, a good complete job. Is it available now? It is available now. The product has been available since 2010. At this show, we are introducing the Botvac D7 Connected, which is a new product. Uh, and, uh, and the new product has a very important feature because now with the maps, the new feature is that we can draw no-go lines 
So we ah. can tell the robot not to go into certain areas without putting uh, without putting physical obstacles, but just drawing a line on the map, as you can see here. Okay, so yeah, I don't know if you, there you go. I'm fighting the TV light glare, but now yeah. Chris is getting a good shot uh, of just lines that you've drawn exactly. on its mapping map. that it did yeah. to say, I don't want you there for whatever exactly. reason. Maybe the dog food bowl is exactly. right there and you don't want exactly. it knocking it over exactly. or, or uh, stairs. Or you have drapes or, or things that you don't want yeah, to get yeah, yeah, into. Yeah, yeah. yeah that, that, that type of thing. So you can easily say, just avoid those areas. Uh, clean those everything those areas or you have <laughs> kids, uh, kids' toys in one area that would get uh, yeah. messed up by the robot. Yeah. So it's available now at what cost, U.S. Uh, dollars? This, this in U.S. dollars would be seven ninety nine, but we have products from three ninety nine to seven ninety nine. Okay, and by seven ninety nine, you don't mean just under eight dollars. You mean just under eight hundred? But we just got under eight dollars. <laughs> yes. But it does a lot of unique things and does a great job of cleaning, no doubt. Uh, absolutely, a uh, great, great dirt pickup, a very large dirt bin, and uh, so it and it can do in three charges. It can do up to forty five hundred square feet house. Wow, so. nice! I yep. wish I had a house that big. But yeah. anyway, <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> but it'll do all the sizes that we need. Neato Robotics dot com. N e a t o Robotics dot com. We'll get you there, of course, when you visit our site at your convenience at intotomorrow.com. Thank you so much for spending a few minutes with us here at IFA and continued good luck to you. Cool stuff. Thank you, Dave. It's been a pleasure. It's okay. our pleasure as well. We're back with more from Berlin, Germany. I'm Dave Graveline as we continue our 15th year broadcasting from IFA here on the Advanced Media Network.